Hi guys, so I'm going to do a short video demonstration on how I practice and play along with the different drones. Now drones have been a huge part of my practice routine and my practice habits for many many years now and they have been such a benefit to my growth not only um, in a musical way when I'm improvising or playing but definitely for compositions too. You know it's a great way to kind of play around with tension and hear different colors moving against like something like a pedal point or, or something really stable so there's a lot of benefits there and I was introduced to drones a long time ago uh, through John McLaughlin in the band Shakti where I would even be lucky enough to go to some sound checks um, I was always fascinated by the color of this drone that they were always improvising over you know depending on the tune would depend on what key the drone was in but it was always there like grounding the music and it just felt so comfortable to me and it felt like there was like a, a bubble around them or, or like a house that they were all living in or, or a, even a bed that you could sleep in you know it felt like something like almost protective about it but it was very interesting to hear the different um, colors played against something um, stable like that so the drones are here for you to download so you could they're all in all 12 keys and they're basically a root and a perfect fifth interval so in the key of C it would be a C and a G and really that root and fifth or that root and perfect fifth is a part of so many different scales and chords and it can be looked at in so many different ways so really we have a lot of possibilities it's not telling if, if it's major it's not telling if it's minor so there's a lot of things to play with so for example if you want to practice along with the modes we can think of this as C Ionian so we can change the tonality to minor so we can play a C Dorian over a drone You know, it's all grounded there. See uh, Lydian. See Mixolydian. I'm not going to bother with Locrian because it has that, that flat 5 in there. So it's not going to work with the drum so well. But you can definitely start messing around with the melodic minor modes. Lydian flat 7. So many stuff. So I'm going to do a demonstration now over the C drone, over the C and the G, and I'm going to start with the modes, and I'm just going to kind of let go and see where where the vibe takes me, you know. And it's again, it's great for your compositional ideas. Just don't be bound by scales so much when you're playing. Just let the creativity guide you where you want it to be and if you find some cool stuff just make a note of it and you know you're going to come up with some interesting composition ideas that are not based in academic but based in like a creative learning and just accepting the ideas that come to you all right so i hope you enjoy and see you soon <laughs> Thank you. 